are you doing now for God that can make him preserve your life if in the next two hours Kronos has timed you to get involved in a fatal accident let me tell you something those who died in accident last week didn't plan to die in accident they were timed they were amazing wives amazing husbands amazing children amazing sons who went out battered washed to go to school they ain't much worry so wake up what is it that God can say there is something this man is doing that I can't let death remove him <laughs> this is what have you aligned your life with God's purpose that God looks at you and says this man is relevant in my hand this woman is serving something of my interest death don't touch him because all you do is get a job get a work manage your fund sleep wake up go to work eat drink get job walk get money sh sh go home go work what are you doing for god what is that aspect of your life that makes you look like a fool before people but wise before god because the bible says the wisdom of god is foolishness to natural men and the wisdom of men is foolishness before god so that's what it is these are two par parallel lines that can never match the ways of god will always be foolishness to intellectual men and the ways of intellectual men will always be foolishness before God. And that's what the Bible says. A fool says in his heart, there is no God. So what is that aspect of your life that makes you a fool before men? That you have held on to? These are the reasons God can say, protect that one. Protect his family. Protect her family. Do you know how many that, that, that have sought after my life? Do you know how many that, how, how they've got gathered to set me up? Do you know? Do you know what I've been through that God has continued to deliver me from? My influence internationally have attracted international jealousy and attacks. I'm not a local, you know, pastor. Pastor John is known all over the world all over there is nowhere in the world that they don't know me all over the world so the higher you go they higher the attacks they higher the grace also so what is it that god can look upon to say keep that man away from that danger keep that family away from that danger That's what Jesus gave us in the secret of his prayer. He says, when you pray, pray, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Are you committed to kingdom advancement?